Shamsun's wondering, where does quarantine male leopard fit in the dynamics of the other leopards? So he's Karula's last successful litter, so before these current cubs. And she had one other litter in between that was unfortunately killed by hyenas. So this is her last successful litter. She had two boys. And from a leopard dynamic, well, there's they could be born to uh, a male up in the north, or they could be born to Mvula, or they could even be born to Tingana. Kulas probably mated with all three of those uh, at that stage. Well, I think there was another male leopard around, but that was before my time. But it's very, very difficult to guess who the male leopard is without the genetics. So the o only way to tell a, a leopard's father is actually to do genetic tests and there is an ongoing study so hopefully in the next year or so we will find out who exactly is daddy dearest to quarantine Konuma and some of the other leopards around here. I see even though he's an absolutely flat cat his ear does a little pan around like a little radar dish seeing if he can pick up the sound of any creatures Morning, Alice in Oregon. Alice is wondering, which is the most acute sense in a leopard? Is it eyesight? Is it smell? Is it hearing? Oh, I would have to say it's probably hearing and eyesight. Ow, and smell, they're, they're very good, all their senses. Now, their sight works a little bit differently from the way ours do. They don't see the detail that we do, and they also only see in grey. So their eyes are sort of designed to pick up movement uh, rather than detail. So... But their hearing is also exceptional. 